right, so this is now our third drawing. Now we're going to be constructing a perpendicular to the end of a given line. Now, our given line, let us see that our given line is AB. AB. So AB is our given line. Now we're going to be constructing our perpendicular to the end of our given line. Which end would we want to use? So let us use the end at A. We're going to be constructing a perpendicular at A. Now, what I will be doing in green students will be in construction line. So I will simply extend my given line. Say about this. I simply extend my given line, you know, at A. So I'm going to be constructing a perpendicular at A. Now I get my compass and uh, I go to A and at A, I'm going to repeat some simple steps. So I'm going to open to a suitable radius and at A, I'm going to swing two arcs. So I swing an arc here and I swing another arc. Now I'm going to be labeling my drawing for your purpose. So this will be C, this will be D. Now what do I do from there? I open my compass to a suitable radius that is going to be greater than AC or greater than AD. So I will go to D. I can open my compass to a radius that is greater than AC or AD. And I will swing an arc. And then I will not adjust nor change the radius of my compass. I will go to C and I will cut that arc. So you know this ABCD, this point now we refer to as E. So having done that those things, I will now draw a line and let me get back my color that I was using blue. So having done that, I will now draw a line through those two arcs to connect to E. So I would have created or constructed a perpendicular to my line AB and it would have been at the end of the line, which is that point A. So we're going to go ahead and practice this drawing.